Aloha, Pisces. Aloha, suns and waters. Let's get right into it. I'm going to get three cards out and read the energy. What does spirit want you to know? What do you want to tell the Pisces, sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs? What's going on, Pisces? I trust you all are doing well. I feel like a, a lot of beautiful things are coming towards you. I feel like it's been... You've been waiting. You've been waiting for some good news. Let's see what's going on with Pisces spirit. What do you want to tell Pisces? Mm -hmm. I like that energy. Somebody's being set free. Being set free or even possibly freeing themselves. Ready to open up. And I feel like with that opening up also comes with you moving past things that you've been holding on to. Could have been a fear of letting go. Moving to calmer waters. Okay, Pisces. Time. Mm -hmm. Time can be seen to be both linear and a spiral. Circle back to explore concepts from the past. And create the future. I just heard it's about time. Somebody may have been feeling like they're going around in a circle. I'm seeing like tornado energy. Like going back in a circle. Going round and around. But I feel the movement happening. It's like... Somebody was once in rough seas and now they're moving to a calm place. Yes, be the light. White witch. So I feel like someone's no longer waiting for someone to set them free. They're doing it themselves. They're shining the light for self. When they may have been in a dark space. Let's see this energy of the white witch. Page 86. definitely in a peaceful state of mind right now our spirit wants you to really be at ease spirit wants you to be patient take the higher road and choose the light remove yourself from lower energy experiences that's definitely what you're doing or being called to do right this is advice from spirit the white witch card represents the maiden aspect of the triple goddess of paganism and modern wicca the maiden is a gentle, innocent, and pure aspect of the goddess, a loving soul who wants nothing but the best for the whole earth. Definitely Pisces energy. Here, she is joined by a horned owl, showing that she is willing to respect those with more vision and experience than she has. But she is also willing to trust what she feels to be right within. With this card, you're being re reminded of the goodness within. No matter what is happening to you or around you, you have a choice. Choose to not be pulled into dramas, bickering, or energies that are just going to limit your joy. If you're surrounded by people who are hostile towards you or someone else, or you are in a negative situation, perhaps in your workplace, you're being invited to be the light. You're an incredible person who can really bring light. So how can you change the energy? How can you redirect the conversation to love? How can you protect yourself? How can you help the person that's being picked on? Or are you the one who is guilty of causing drama? You will know the answers. Know also that you're being encouraged to shine the light. You were born to share. So be in the light in every situation during these times, Pisces. Staying away from drama, gossip, negative energies. 
And it's also about like checking self when you feel you're going down that spiral. You're creating tornadoes. Know when it's time to slow down. When it's time to be calm. When it's time to bring out the sunshine. Bringing out the light in a dark situation. What's the outcome of this energy spirit? What's the outcome of this energy? Mm. Ace of Cups and in reverse and the world. So this instantly gave me the vibe of being more... <clears throat> The outcome. It's like knowing where to give your love. I feel like if somebody has a person here, make sure you're focusing on that person. 